welcome to the channel and today I have a early review for the Dark Trooper Attack. This was supposed to release in about a week and well I found it at Costco and yeah it's been amazing. Unfortunately I couldn't live stream my build it yesterday because there were some problems with it with the live streaming thing on youtube and then so i just did it live stream it but he, i finished building it and well yeah this is a review for the video yes i put these for like my stop motion and the intros i forgot to take them out but this is the set this is actually a pretty nice set it's really neat and there's even this kind of it actually looks good for some reason there's luke over there yeah you can like there's a lot of play features but anyways right now i will start with the minifigure this is luke skywalker and this minifigure is actually pretty good compared to the older version of this the printing on this is a lot better the like uh, the sort of like belt thing is slightly more accurate i think and the robes are probably the same but the main thing is the rope is the cape and this like top of the cape thing the new mold is so that this is like open and sort of like continues over here and like that instead the older version was like was like that and like it's very it's like different different you know like this had this middle part while this is just the newer version is just like the hood part it's just a lot better okay so on the sides nothing really changed here it's just the same and then the for the cape part yeah for the cape part the new cape is a little different if you guys have bought this set then you guys would probably not understand yeah and then the other side it's the same as like the white hands and yeah this luke skywalker is a pretty basic like last time kind of you know it's a pretty cool it's a pretty nice little figure to add to the collection but yeah that's luke skywalker next dark up. trooper yes this is the new dark trooper i really like the new type well not really new type this was the only type of dark trooper lego has ever made i do like the like kind of the same thing on wreckers from bad batch piece it makes the figure like feel a lot wider and more buff you know something i really like is the helmet the helmet as you can see actually has a underprint yeah the print under is a red visor kind of thing and then there's holes in the helmet yeah you can see there is just holes in the helmet yeah, i'm not sure if you guys can see it but yeah there is holes in the helmet and like it's a pretty nice figure and yes if you guys are wondering the under the like wider thing it's actually the same as the like armor piece okay i'll call it armor piece look it's similar just a little bit different it has more detail here and yeah the piece over here is the same the legs are pretty detailed and yeah the hands are just the same yeah so the legs as you can see those have like pretty shiny pieces it sort of is like a 
clone trooper kind of mix with stormtrooper you know it's a pretty nice feat not feature pretty nice little thing on this and yes there is a like oh, there's this like chrome kind of thing here but yeah the helmet does look a little bit weird on the back well, that see it's like you know anyways so with the piece back on now the gun is one of my favorites i do like the binocular piece extend from the i think this is the same gun as the one that uh bobo fett uses yeah it's the same anyways yeah this is the dark trooper and there is three in this set so yeah now let's move on to the play features so play feature number one is probably this but it sort of doesn't work but yeah it's this thing that turns it's like the elevator yeah you can turn it using this piece this like, joint but sometimes you have to make sure Luke's like okay i'll show you like this you have to make sure luke's hand is not caught outside so when you can see the top thing over here yeah that's when it goes beep 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 and then it just it turns and then luke comes here with his lightsaber a thing that i really don't like about this feature is that sometimes the lightsaber gets stuck like if i show you the thing is probably gonna get stuck so look you put his lightsaber here and there is one way that i i saw how to do it like yesterday i was playing with the set yeah yesterday and then so if you do the hand like good enough then yeah it's a little hard to see i'm just not gonna try anyways it's just too hard to do it because like it will like the lightsaber part really is a hard thing but yeah turning back here that is it's like one of the main features it turns oh yeah and the and the little thing here that i i'm not a big fan is this it happens like quite a lot the cape gets stuck and then you have to pull it out and then it just sort of like breaks the fabric which is not really good and like yeah it's just annoying but yeah anyways with saber on now you can like put him over here and then there's a little play feature when you're building it like this so if you put this here you can like if this guy's over here and then you're, you turn him and if he's not like you spin really fast you can like like, like yeah you get it right and then so there's another feature over here look so this guy use the force and then he just pushes him back it's not one of the best things i'd say but eh. you it's pretty good for stop motion uses and it just goes and sometimes it falls off which is sort of like a good thing like, but eh. it just like, yeah there are three dark troopers here and i don't really get why they put this here i'm not sure it's probably like it's more cheaper to do that or something because it's six studs wide they could easily just put like another column or something here here and there you know and then it will just become pretty good i don't know why and another pretty cool thing is this if you're actually animating like what i sometimes do i change the lights here and yeah 
but a disclaimer to this thing this set is there is a lot 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 of stickers that's why it's probably a plus but you can just ask your parents to do it for you for the stickers there's none of these pieces are printed this sticker this sticker that sticker that sticker that's all our sticker except that because that's a actual piece yeah there's a texture of the piece but yeah okay you get it right Anyways, this is the Dark Trooper Attack, and I actually really like the set. It's a nice little new thing to add to my collection, and the minifigures are really decent, and if there was, like, a Moff Gideon, it would be, like, a lot better, but, well, Moff Gideon wasn't, like, really in the scene, but, yeah, it's only for, like, a $30 set, but I bought it for, like, two dollars anyways it was on set but yeah so this set is a really decent one but if you guys like it you guys can go to like costco to find some but yeah thank you everybody for watching and i'll see you guys in the next one goodbye